the baton, like all the other instruments in the orchestra, although this doesn't make any noise, helps to realize the conductor's, or the composer's ideal. I got a call, must be like 2021, and it was from Joel Weaver, who said he was the props guy for Maestro. They wanted to use a Bernstein baton, as authentic as possible. Bernstein is buried with a, a copy of, I guess, his Mahler's Fifth Symphony score in Greenwood Cemetery in Brooklyn. And although I haven't checked personally, he's supposed to also be buried with one of my dad's batons. Joel called me and he said, we want some batons for the movie. Um, can you make them? And I said, sure. So Cooper, I don't remember exactly what he said and what Joel told me that, that uh, Bradley said, but he definitely liked the batons and that's why he wanted to, to use them. This is the handle that I have for a, a Bernstein baton. And so it ends up typically around 16 or 17 inches down here. My dad, uh, Dick Horowitz, who played at the Met Opera for a lifetime, retired at age 88. He was known as Mr. Fix-It at the Met Opera. He was rehearsing opera. Bernstein was conducting Candide rehearsal in the same building. And Bernstein broke his baton and the librarian found my dad and asked him if he could fix it. He said, I'll, I'll make another baton. And that's what he did. Uh, he, li he liked it enough that from that point forward, he was sort of his baton maker. So the other part of the operation is actually making the handles. This is a piece of composite cork. When my dad died in 2015, some of his clients who I had not been in contact with, you know, they wanted to know if, um, you know, if Dick was still alive and they need some batons. And so I took all of his materials, his, uh, all of his uh, birch dowels, probably at least a thousand. I took all of his cork and I took all the batons that I could find in his shop. There's, there's no, no way to predict what somebody is going to want. And I doubt if even the conductor would know. So that's part of the reason that when I meet, meet somebody who's interested in having batons, I'll take them 20 batons so they can pick them up, feel the weight, feel the balance, feel the handles. It's a matter of what's comfortable for them.